The following segment is sponsored by Geisinger Holy Spirit. People break their bones very frequently and, you know, it's important to be able to treat them properly. Fractures or broken bones comprise about half of all traumatic injuries. At Geisinger Holy Spirit, Dr. Yelena Bogdan brings up the importance of their trauma center and when to seek such care for broken bones. So there are different types of fractures. There's the fractures you sustain as a result of trauma. A common form of trauma that Dr. Bogdan sees in central Pennsylvania relate to car accidents or farmer accidents, types that require immediate attention. Anything in the arms and legs, specifically very severe fractures such as those involving joints and fractures of the pelvis. There are a few ways to treat a traumatic injury. This is where a trauma center comes into play. We are specifically trained to know when to go to the operating room and more importantly, when not to go to the operating room. In many cases, surgery is not needed for these types of bone fractures. And I think it's important for people to understand that many uh, fractures can be treated with casting, with splinting, with a lot of different non-operative um, management modalities before you go on to surgery. Specific injuries common amongst the elderly, such as hip fractures, usually require surgery. The trauma center has dedicated trauma rooms, so there are special operating rooms which are solely dedicated to trauma patients. Another advantage of a traumatology trained surgeon is the overall outcome of the surgery when related to traumatic fractures. We do the fracture care faster, more efficiently, and we have less of a chance of doing it incorrectly or malaligning the bone, which means putting it together not perfectly. For this week's Doc Talk, I'm Chris Nallen.